Hey girlies, we're back with another Abercrombie try on. Another sale this weekend, 25% off jackets and coats, 15% off almost everything else. Um, I will put the details in the description down below and the dates if you're watching this video outside of those dates. Again, remember they're always doing sales. There's always codes pretty much from like Friday to Monday, sometimes Thursday through Tuesday. They have sales and codes that work. So if it's outside of the dates, comment down below or come DM me over on Instagram and I'll let you know what the current sale is of the day that you're watching this. But I've got, I like do have an Abercrombie TM, but then I just have these comfy shorts for now before we start. I've got a few things that I picked up at the mall this week actually, and one is a jacket. And then these are a couple skirts that I got in the mail. So we're gonna try that stuff on because it's new and then I'll probably add some recent pieces that I picked up. I'm also going to see if I have any jackets from previous years um, that they came out with again this year. So blazers are included as part as a jacket or a coat in the 25% off. I have this blazer in a few different colors. The black is still highly stocked at the moment. Obviously that could change. I wear them in a small true to size. I just paired it over this little, the little tee I already had on. And then I put on the viral 90s ultra high rise straight jeans. These are the light wash. They're always available. They're just such a good staple jean. And I threw on some neutral boots. But yeah, these are all pieces I already had. Switched out the tee and blazer for this cardigan. I already have this cardigan in cream you would have seen in a previous try on and I love it. I did wear it for a date night last weekend. Um, I actually wore it with like a little crop top underneath. It was so cute. So when I was in the mall and saw that they had gray, I, I immediately wanted the gray. Um, and then I realized it actually comes in dark gray, but I didn't see the dark gray in the mall. So the dark gray is currently in my cart. I don't know if three is too many, but this is obviously like, this is like super light gray with, when you look really close, it almost looks like gray and cream like pieces combined versus the dark gray's dark. So is it okay to have three? I don't know. It also comes in really dark brown, but the dark brown, the sizes have been super limited, so I haven't been able to snag it. Uh, I did size down to an extra small, and it's interesting because I feel like the cream one fit bigger than this one. So I don't know, maybe that one just got stretched out, but whatever. It's fine. Um, it's just so cute. It looks so good just by itself, and you can mess around with like, have one button at the top open, one button at the bottom open. I could button this, I could button it all the way up, I could unbutton more, whatever you want to do. Um, or you can wear it open, like I said I did, but it's just such a cute sweater, not itchy, no wool. Wool never will I buy anything with wool, even 1%, because I'm so sensitive. I have this new score on. I already have this score in black. I actually wore it last weekend with the cream pearl button down cardigan. So cute. So after I wore it, I like wanted it in every color, probably before I wore it. Um, so I got the cream and I also have the red today that I'm gonna show you. It is so cute. Um, it's a small, fits perfectly, has shorts underneath. Like I've said, wouldn't do a mini skirt like this without <laughs> the short. And this is a brown sweater from Abercrombie last year, but I know I've seen super similar online this year, so I will just link something similar. And then I just put on some loafers for like a preppy look. These are the only pair of loafers I have. They're by Sam Edelman. I really, really like them. I feel like they go with a lot and they look cute with skirts or pants or jeans or honestly just whatever but yeah I absolutely love this skirt I feel like it's just the perfect little piece um and it also comes in like a dark gray pinstripe but I don't think there was a small a small available in that and then it also comes in a navy which I'm just and I had to wear navy skirts <laughs> all growing up in private school, so I don't really want a navy skirt. Another skirt I'm gonna try on for you too, that's a wrap skirt, so if you like that style better, then it comes in multiple colors as well. Here is the same skirt, but in red. Like I said, it's so cute. It's so perfect for the holidays. I feel like you could dress this 
so many different ways. I paired it with the same pearl cardigan in cream. Like I said, this cardigan, cardigan is just so good, but I feel like it would look good with like more of an oversized sweater as well. And I feel like you could do cream, white, black, brown. You could do a monochromatic look too with all red. Um, and then I put on these Dolce Vita slides. I love these. They are so comfortable. First I had the loafers on, but I wasn't quite liking the look and I don't have a black bag so I feel like the black loafers would be cute if I had a black bag not that I think your shoes and bag need to match but I just feel like with the dark like with the loafers being dark I needed something else so I'm my next wish list designer piece is a black bag I really want the black YSL shoulder bag I've I wanted to show you guys this Sherpa puffer so mine is years old at least two, maybe three years old. Um, I may have even had this before I started Rose Gold, so it's a while, but I love it. And they came out with one this year that's super similar. It's just a Sherpa puffer, basically. So I don't know that I'd necessarily do it over this cardigan because it feels really scrunched in there, but I just love Abercrombie's puffers. I obviously don't get to wear them too much in Florida, but a couple days a year, and then if I do any traveling, um, just good to have in my closet. So like I said, this has been in my closet for years. This is a small, but if you wanted to be able to layer like over sweaters more comfortably, then I would size, size up. New piece is this jacket. So it's a YPB jacket. I saw it in the store. I wanted a little black fleecy jacket like this and they have a couple options, but I got the one that has the elastic band around the waist. There's also an option that's just more, doesn't have it, it's just straight down and flat. So I'll link that as well. This has a detachable hood, which I think is great. So if you don't want the hood, you just zipper it off. Um, it comes in, I know my mom actually got it in like a tan, but then it's lined with black. So definitely color options. I put on these cargo joggers from Abercrombie. I love these, so comfy. Just some black sneakers, but this is just such a good piece. And I feel like in Florida, I will get good use out of this because it's not like super, super bulky, but it'll be a good outer layer for me when we do get a little bit of cooler weather. I'm wearing it in the small, so true to size, I just have a little sports bra underneath, but like definitely the perfect like active wear layer. It's a vegan leather puffer, and I believe I got this last year, and from what I can tell, this year it's like the ultra mini puffer, and this might just be the regular mini. It looks like it's a little bit more on the crop side with like an elastic band on the bottom, um, but you know, I've already got this one, so this one's good enough, but this is a small, same thing where if you wanted to like have more of a bulk underneath, then go ahead and size up, but just another great staple jacket. New piece I have is this wrap skirt. So very similar to the other skirt I shared. It just has the wrapped look. It's just it's faux it still just sits on the side exactly like the other ones as has the shorts underneath um, this one is available in different colors as well I wanted a gray one so I saw this in the store quickly snagged it it is a small so true to size have the same cardigan on same neutral boots I had on earlier that's it for today's haul as always let me know your favorite piece down below subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you next time bye